This is a quick look at the two different types of impactor bits by Vera. There's the impactor 1 and the impactor 2, and I really struggled to find any information online about the difference between those bits, so I'm just going to show you them. Now, you can buy them individually, I think, or in these sets. Um, and as I understand it, the impactor 2 bit, this one, is just a straight bit holder. It doesn't do anything, so it has a magnetic attachment and the bit slots in and that's it. Um, it's just a single straight bit holder. This doesn't move, nothing changes, it just sits in there. Whereas the impactor one, your bit goes in and then this collar can slide up and down. And when you slide it along, it can it has a magnet here that holds the head of the screw. See that the magnet at the end has collected a bit of shrapnel along the way. Um, the This collar, when it slides out, there's nothing to, to hold it there, so it kind of moves back and forth freely. So it means if you do turn it up the way and you're screwing upwards, then it will fall back down as soon as it loses contact with the screw. And then this magnet at the top will make contact with the inside of the shaft and then it'll snap onto it. So it gets stuck down in the bottom position, but it doesn't get stuck open. Um, if I put a bit in there, you can see that it holds the screw fairly well. Has it got a magnetic? No, there's not really a magnetic attachment there. And so you have to slide this up. But once you slide that up, then it's a pretty rock solid magnetic attachment because the screw is, is attached to this ring magnet at the end. Right, it's pretty solid. The only thing that I find slightly challenging with it is if you have a screw there and this is down there, then you can't see the head of the screw. So if you're driving that into a bit of wood, you don't know how deep it's gone until you slide this back and then have a look. Um, in comparison, the Impactor 2 is more like a standard bit holder. So there's a magnet, or the whole thing is magnetic, so it will hold a screw, but it doesn't have the same sliding collar, and so the magnet, I guess, is not quite as powerful or not quite as strong but still fairly strong. But yeah, the magnet on this one, rock solid. And you can even ha you can either have it there or you can slide it back and not have it at all. That's the difference between these two impactor bit holders. Hopefully you find it useful. Um, I guess they're both useful for different applications.